Hi guys, so today I'll be teaching you how to make a Kawaii Stingray, and this is a collaboration with Cutesy Creations. We did a beach-themed collab, and I recommend using the quartz colors for these because they end up really pretty in the end. And if you don't have a quartz-colored clay, just mix the color of your choice, translucent, and pearl. Um, so first you kind of want to make a rounded diamond shape, I guess. Um, this is going to be for like the body and the wings of the Stingray, I guess, if that's what you call Stingray. It should look like that. Then take a ball of the same colored clay and flatten it on top of the diamond shape and then you can just kind of like blend it with a large dotting tool I'd recommend and your finger. And you can indent kind of like a little notch for like the nose if you want. Then um, roll out a snake of the same colored clay and attach it onto the back for the tail and blend it. And then um, you can kind of just roll out a lighter colored clay, put the body that you just made on top of it, and cut around. And then you can indent a hole for the mouth, I just find it to be a lot cuter. And then you can curve up the wings of the stingray. So then um, you can indent your eyes, you know, make your usual eyes. Um, and you can add eyelashes if you want, I just didn't for this one. And there's kind of the imitation for the nose. Then add an eye pin, and before you bake, you can shade on the cheeks with blush. I just used this color out of the favorite Castell, I think it was like the 48 set pack. So then you can just bake this. And um, now we're going to paint on the spots, and I use this outdoor opaque cobalt color. Make sure it's acrylic paint. And you can just kind of dot on random patterns of dots, I guess. It doesn't really matter. Um, how you do it. You can't really mess up, I don't think. I just use a dotting tool and just dot on random dots. You can do it on the wings too, I just chose to do it on the main body because I think it looks a lot more formal, but you can do whatever because obviously in real life it's not like that. And then I added some glitter glue onto the back and glazed it, and then you're done. So I hope you enjoyed this. Bye!